Shalom, shalom, world. Um, just going to speak real quick about just everything what's going on. And like what's our objective as the tribe to do to the Most High God. Uh, I want to start off all praise, all glory goes to the Most High God, the creator of heaven and earth, the only one, the only true creator. Um, a lot of um, people have been asking me questions about the tribe and about can they find their tribe and things of that nature. Yeah, you can find your tribe. Um, but my job is to get out the word of the Most High God through our nation. And that's what I'm doing. Like... Everybody, they fail to misunderstand what we truly talking about, which is the serving of the Most High God. A lot of people like to say, let's take, let's take God out of it. Let's put the Bible to the side. I can't do that, me personally. I can't do that because my whole life was based on it. So... For if you want to put that to the side, that's you. You are you done chose your side. I'm not here for you. If you even put that to the side, I'm not I'm not here for that. I'm like we here for the lost sheep of Israel. Literally, this is what I'm here for. This is what I'm helping out to do. This is what we're doing. And for those sheep, that you need to leave the that other nation, all other nations. Cause every nation that don't serve the Most High God, they 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 come they 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 basically they come in to be judged. And this nation that we stand on is of the Most High God, the Creator, the only one God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, the only one. And that's what we stand on, and that's what we're gonna keep pushing. A lot of people want to say, "Ah, oh, take it out, take it out, put it to the side." Nah, you put you gonna put your jeepers to the side. When you want to. With this, we can't put nothing to the side. This ain't going to the side. So for all the other tribes talking about, oh, let's just come together. We could put this to the side. We could just come come together and just uh, uh, black power. Man, stop. We not doing that. If we can't come together with the understanding of the Most High God, that he gave this land to us, that this is our kingdom, that this is ours and he gave it to us. If we can't come together like that and we trying to come together with, uh, well, I think in 1962 this happened or, yeah, this did happen in 1962. This happened in 1492. All of this happened. But at the end of the day, that's going off of your own knowledge. We strictly going off of the Most High God. Whatever he want us to move, he want us to make, that's how we can rock it. And that's what it is. And with with that being said, um, the Most High God, He's doing more and more as the time goes on. He's doing more. Um, it is urgent for every child of the Most High God to leave the other nations because you are subjected to those nations. Subjected, like literally, you're subjected to those nations. Literally. And you want to leave you unless you accept Babylonian laws. And all every wicked thing that they are doing, laws that they have passed, every wicked law that goes against the most high God, their nation goes against it also. So Every member or every citizen in that nation, wherever it is, you're going to suffer the consequences also. If your heart isn't there, we understand. We understand if, you're, if your heart isn't there, no, you won't suffer. You won't suffer. As long as you, suck, you, you, you basically circumcised, you, you did your heart. You gotta, we, we gotta get all, these are the times that we gotta get all that hate out of our heart. Everybody thinking like, oh, this is a tribe, we coming together. Yes, it is a tribe. It's bigger than a tribe. We're a government. But at the end of the day, we follow the Most High God laws, like, strictly. And when I say laws, I'm talking about 
walking it. I'm not. I'm not. When I say laws, I'm talking about we literally walk what we speak. We literally have it in our heart to treat the people right. We literally have it in our heart. The other nations, they don't. They are looking to make money off the off the people. Not only that, that's not even the that's that's not even far the worst part. That's not that's not nothing compared to the laws that they are passing that is making our people sin. Not even knowing it. Just thinking, oh, you in this world, blah blah blah, you just living. So if you a sinner, you go, don't even look at the, like, you already know what time is hitting on. We don't have time. I'm not here to tell, preach the Bible. That's not my job. You got other people out there that do that, that they're telling you, like, yo, get right. But my job is just straight tell you, like, yo, if you with that nation, that's cool. This is a nation for the righteous ones. If you have upheld your heart with, within all these years and you tried your best of your ability to walk with an upright heart, this is who you want to holler at. This is where, this the government, this the nation, where you want to holler at. This who you want to holler at, this nation. The nation of Israel, United Nations. We got to get right. Or you don't have to join. You can just stay and just, you got stay in that nation and you can still have an upright heart. But at the end of the day, you still with that nation. You with the nation that doesn't care. You with the nation that literally want to kill you and your people. So why is you with them? Not only for the Israelites. Not only for the for, for, for us, for the Gentiles also. If you know that these people are wicked, if I know I came from a lineage that is wicked, they are murderers, thieves, all of this, I would, me personally, I will, I have to claim them as family, but to say that I want to be a part of them, no. I don't want to be a part. If my family rock like that, I don't want to be a part of them. I just don't. I just don't. So this right here is for the righteous ones. Like, literally. I don't know how many times I done said it, but I'm going to keep saying it. Because it's going to be a repetitive thing. Like, I know we, we doing a lot of things with the government. License plates, tags, all of that. We're doing a lot of great things. Do and through to the Most High High. God, through him. That's how we doing what we doing. We couldn't do this just because we say, oh, we Indians. Hey, hey we Indians. Yeah, yeah, we go around the fire a few times. Like, no. Before we, when we was going around the fire doing that, we was straight praising the most high God. Doing things. Real, real, real things. Not playing around with it. And I see a lot of Indian tribes, yeah, yeah, they rebirth, but they're not putting the Most High God first. So you could have all of this idea and all of these plans. I know for me, it may prosper for those tribes depending on who their God is. You see what I mean? I know for our tribe and our government and our nation, we only we got to put him first. We got to put him first. A lot of people ain't going to like what I'm saying. They don't like what I'm saying. I don't care. I'm not here to be a friend to anyone. I'm here to just get my job done. If you don't like what I'm saying, that's cool. But I know who we are. And I know our people. And for the Yuchis and for the Kusos come out of her. I know directly y'all are people. Come out of her. Like, we got to. We must. We must. This is what it's about. The Most High God, the creator of, of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. 
That's all I really could say right now. He the only one. He made this happen. He did. Not he helped. He he worked through me to get to to make this possible. That's all what's really going on. That's what's going on, and I love him for it. And every day we walk in freedom. We don't have to like we don't like the other nations. They they the they their so called officers, their constables, get behind us and. They already know the deal. Like, don't play with us. This our land. It's our government. You better go ahead and shoot around us and go and pull one of your members, one of your citizens. We not playing like that. I don't care where we at. We this our land, and this is what we gotta get into our heads. This is our territory. It's no. Well, oh, can we do this? Oh, if I gave whoever I gave the card to. A driver's license, uh, membership, passport. If it is what it is, it is what it is. I'm not asking. I didn't. What? This is how the Most High God gave me that authority. I use mine every day. I use my credentials every day. And then I just pass it on to through the tribal members, through the citizens. They get the same credentials. But it's up to that individual to understand this. Also, that's what it is. You got to understand. Like, um, faith without works, it ain't nothing. Uh, just by me using my ID, driving down the road with my license plates, just by letting them see that it's alive and we're not dead anymore. We're getting stronger every day. We growing every day. The nation is waking up. And that's what we doing here. We reshifting. We, we building this kingdom. Our laws ain't their laws. So a lot of things are going to be different. A lot of things are going to be different. The whole everything, man, it's going to be different than even the word for it. Different is not the word. And it's a lot about to go down too. But only... The ones who has been walking that wicked life and don't have him, they're going to fear. They are going to fear what's going on in these last days, in these times that we're in. They're going to really fear it. And with the ones, even the Gentiles, the ones who've been walking that upright, hard life, they, that that real hearted life, like you know what I'm talking about, like that. That got that pure heart. That's all I'm talking about. If you was walking that life of that pure heart, not trying to hurt nobody and being respectful, like all of that, you'd be respectful as all that. But they ain't got nothing to do with the heart. As long as that heart was clear, as long as you ain't want no evil, ain't had no evil on your heart. If you was walking that, these are the times to literally get right. These are the times to. Basically, clean your heart even more, and subdue. Get 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 yourself away from that other nation, cause they are falling, and the ones who is with them gonna fall along with them. That's just how it go. Birds of feather fall out together. So, for the for for. Everyone, you want to literally get right with the Most High God. Like, literally, you want to seek out your heart. All them feelings and them emotions, you don't like this person, you don't like that person. These are the times to get that out of your heart. Because it, it's not about your feelings. It's about the realness, the truth, the, 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 the truth of the matter. Like, it's, it's about, that's, it's about the, the pure heart having... Re, like having um, mercy on the, on the next, like literally, and not being sorrowful and pitiful for them, but like basically like uh, not like you feel sorry for them because they're they've been sinning type thing. No, I'm talking about like if you give them anything, if if you see them hungry, you'll give it to them. You know what I mean? That's real. That's a pure heart, like literally, and. 
Um, another thing is also with um, the ones who do got your IDs and driver's license and everything, we got to exercise it. We, 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 we got to exercise our rights. And we got to do it more. You know what I mean? Um, the definition of exercise. Activity required physical effort carried out to sustain or improve health and fitness. They talking about for health or fitness in this manner. But the when you exercise not only your health, well, I guess you can put this in the health and the fitness thing category with the ID cards because every time I use my ID cards it's exercising. The 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 bartender, whoever it is, they get used to it. Like, oh, okay, that's exercising. And it's gonna get stronger. So each member around the globe we're going to just get stronger. This is our nation. And I need us to know that. And put that in our head. I'm not asking them folks for nothing. We're not buying nothing that we already own. It's ours. All like We're not doing that. So we need to exercise our rights. Not only exercise our rights with our ID cards. Exercise your rights in the Most High God also. In these laws. Exercise them laws also. I still got working on to do. We only human. I'm exercising every day. Exercising, exercising, and exercising. Not only physical we need to exercise, but mentally. Mentally. And using your, your credentials of another nation, of our nation, is exercising. It's making it stronger. And that's what we need. Um... Not only that, also, um, like, we need to, I got to push, push this into our heads of exercising, of, um, we got to just, every day, whatever we're doing, we got to keep going, we just got to keep going, you know what I mean, um, exercising every day in our tribal status, the Most High God have given us a new identity, a whole new identity. Uh, it's we the same people, but he have reconstructed and rebirthed our identity, shall I say. He rebirthed our identity. And we must exercise our new identity. This is us. This is we the ones of this land. What can we do about that? We can't help that. We can't help our hearts. We can't help who we are. So we must accept it. We got to accept it. We all must accept it. And um, um, we're not going to exercise down the street, marching, 